Hey guys, Pydunit79 here. I just thought I'd make a quick video showing you guys how would, I'm gonna wrap up my uh, MK48 uh, Tomahawk handle. So I'm just gonna wrap this up so it's a little bit more comfortable and it doesn't move with the uh, the cables at all. So uh, right now it's pretty tight but it could be better so it's still still got some movement and stuff so uh, what I ordered is some um, heat shrink tubing this is 30 millimeter uh, I don't know if I can show you guys somewhere around there yeah it says 30 right there 30 so um, 30 millimeter which seem to be not the right size for it I kinda wish I didn't order two because this one is barely fitting in there but it's not fitting with the cable so uh yeah i should have you know waited and make some calculation to see really at the size uh how it would be but i also ordered another 50 millimeter this one is without the um hopefully without the uh the adhesive, adhesive inside so maybe i'm gonna have to make sure before i start but i don't think there's some adhesive in there so although it is pretty tight so what I'm gonna do is cut myself a little piece make a test run just, no I think I already made a test run with this thing and it doesn't have any adhesive so alright so uh, hopefully I'm not gonna mess this up so what I'm gonna do is just measure how much I want so about there uh, that should be good so I'm just gonna cut right here Maybe a little bit more. Give myself a little room to play with. So here we go. So I got that, which is going to be perfect for the size that I want to put. Now I'm going to just stretch that out a little bit, stuck together inside. Hopefully, like I said, it's not the glued version, which I think I made some tests on this already. But so. Now you just gotta get it unstuck. All right, let's, so let's just take the tomahawk and just push it in there so it'll it'll get unstuck with me pulling through. Hopefully, oh yeah, there we go. Alright, so I'm just gonna put the lanyard back. Just gonna put it like so. Should be good. So let's start the shrinking process. What I'm gonna use for that is my flame gun. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I'm gonna use fire, so. So as you guys can see the results are pretty good as I expected it's not the uh, sticky glue version so whew, that's hot so I'm probably gonna have to wait for this to cool down a little bit put it on the ground it'll help 
with the cool down but you guys can see the uh, the results I mean it just gives it a cool look and it's something that's removable so if you need to have access to your uh, to your uh, paracord after that you still get access so I'm just gonna have to wait for it to cool down so I can I can use that but right now I think it's a pretty good fit I might have to just cut the excess here I'll see if I do that so if I leave it there or not but maybe I'll cut it just to make it but it's it gives it a pretty cool look right now it's still cooling off so let's leave it like that a little bit so yeah if you want to wrap your MK48 you're gonna have to need the 50 uh, the 30 is just not just not big enough for uh, wrapping that so uh, kind of a shame though the 30 I ordered another pack of that so but it'll be useful for other things uh, probably some knives or something if I order and they just get some handle without anything on it so and this one is a little bit more flimsy too the, di the diameter is just a little bit flimsier than this one so I don't know if you guys can tell it's a little bit more robust on the 50 millimeter uh, you can get that on Amazon you can get that pretty much everywhere so alright it's cooling down a little so it's hardening so wow it's just the feel that the rubber feel of it is just wow it's just so much better wow this this thing is really comfortable <laughs> wow can't wait to go play with that and just try it out but it seems pretty solid it's not gonna go anywhere sweet wow all I can say is this thing does and it gives it some grip wow wow can't wait to play with that and just look at the look that it gives it wow this is just this is the best so hope you guys enjoyed this quick little uh, video on how I rubberize my uh, my tomahawk handle really pleased how it turned out and maybe just gonna make some aesthetic uh, just you know trimming it out and stuff like that so but you know until then guys uh, just if you want to wrap any handle your knives or whatever just use shrink wrap inexpensive easy solution it rubberize it I don't know if it's gonna be if it's you know you you put some water on there if it's gonna be a uh, you know as grippy but uh, right now this is pretty good and you know I'm really pleased with the results so can't wait to go try that out and you know test it out if it holds on under uh, under pressure and under use so hope you guys enjoyed this little video and I'll see you guys on the next one